other beauties, your girl Eunice Marie here and today I have another natural product for you guys and this is going to be the brand Pacifica. I have ran into Pacifica or I have tried something from Pacifica. I want to say maybe it was like a year ago or so or maybe a little bit more over a year when I was subscribed to Ipsy. You guys know that I ditched a lot of or I ditched altogether using anything that is not natural on my skin so I stopped going to Victoria's Secret and I stopped buying my lovely Victoria's Secret so I went to Pacifica.com and I was like let me get a few things from there and see how I feel about them so I'm going to show you guys what I got first um, prices and everything and then we're going to talk about how I feel when it comes to the Pacifica products that I did get okay so first let's talk about the perfumes that I got because that initially is what I really wanted to try from Pacifica was the perfumes so I wanted to try them I wanted to try about four of them or so but them individually were about I think they were originally how much were they I think they were originally like 12 bucks for the roll-ons but I had a you get a 10% or 10 or 15% off coupon when you first sign up with them so I used that towards my purchase so I got everything here for about $37 and that included shipping which is not bad so I will definitely leave links down below um, to Pacifica like their whole website and everything like that where you can sign up and take a look at what they have as well so everything that I talk about here will be listed down below so I first got this one um, set called Wonderless Roll On Trio and it came in a little pink box like this and on the inside it came with these three scents here so it came with three these three scents which are Indian coconut nectar island vanilla and Tuscan blood orange so I got these for about what's I got all these for 16.15 but I believe the original price on them is it 30 or something like that because they were like on a sell or something when I got them so I don't remember exactly what the original price was but I will leave it down below a little bit about their um, perfume so their perfumes are 100% vegan and cruelty free take these with you wherever you go natural gray alcohol and Pacifica signature blend with natural and essential oils easy to apply and even easier to fall in love with so that is the kind of there's no parabens, no um, no propylene glycol, or no phylates. Is that how you say that? Phylates? Phylates? Is that, am I saying that right? I'll leave it right here. But um, yeah, so they're all natural, no parabens, no none of that, okay? So let's get into these scents. So the first scent that I initially really, really wanted was the vanilla, Island Vanilla. Comes in a nice little box like this. And you guys know that I love warm scents. I love vanillas. I like coconuts. I like ambers. I am a big fan of warm scents. So I got this one here and it's just I got the roll-ons because I wanted to try these scents out first before buying or thinking about buying a full-size bottle. So this one here, it took some time for me to actually like it. I think when I first tried it and I first put it on, I was like, eh, I don't really like it like that. But now I am in love with it. It smells so good, you guys. It smells so good. Oh my goodness. It took some time for me to actually, I think, get used to it because it doesn't have all that synthetic vanilla that we're used to. So it took me some time. Like I was like, I don't know. And then I got a compliment on it like when I first wore it. And I started to actually, you know, get used to the smell and actually smell it it smells divine like this right here I would say get your hands on it oh my goodness it is definitely a vanilla so I love that a lot um love it love it a lot it's actually I would definitely buy a full size of that definitely the next one that came in this trio is the Indian coconut nectar oh this one is another one of my favorites <laughs> And you know what too? These layer really, really well. They layer so well. You can layer them and it smells so divine. Oh my goodness. Oh, you guys. Coconut nectar is the bomb. 
Indian Coconut Nectar is the bomb.com. Like, I would buy a full of this as well. You guys. So we need to go any further. Coconut Nectar. And then the last one that came in this set was... Oh. Uh-oh. The last one that came in... in uh, the last one that came in this set was the Blood Orange or the Tuscan Blood Orange. And like I said, I got a sample of the body butter or the hand cream of this so I was very familiar with this scent I'm not a big big fan of nectars or oranges and things like that but this has an undertone of some spiciness to it so I don't mind it I like the way that the um, hand cream smelled a lot too so it just smells it's citrusy it has that orange to it but it has a spiciness to it too, so it's not, you know, too orangey. Out of all of them, I would say this is, out of this whole trio, this is my least favorite. I wouldn't grab for this as much as I would grab for these two here. And I feel like I can layer these two and wear them alone and they work perfectly. They work in unison really, really well. As with this one, I probably will have to be a little bit careful. I'll probably wear it every now and then, but not as in with combination with the other ones. But they smell really good, okay? And then they had another one called um, Spiced Amber or Sugared Amber Dreams, which is this one. And I was really curious. I was like, ugh, I love amber. So I had to get my hands on something that was amber. So I went ahead and I got this one. And it's definitely a woodsy scent definitely a woodsy scent it has a little bit of a sweetness afterwards but it's more so of a woodsy i guess you could say like top note i like it i think once again this would be great to combine with one of these scents they just all kind of go together you can layer them and i really do like that about these now the size of these they are 33 fluid ounces or 10 ml and um, these are good because I like the fact that you can just throw them in your purse and you don't have to worry about spraying it on in public or anything. Like you just take it, roll it on real quick and you're good. I like that they're kind of more discreet and you know they're really good at layering and I like the fact that I like the roll on a lot. And it's a metal ball roll on. It's not a plastic or anything. It is a metal ball um, roll on. So I like these a lot. Um, I've been wearing them for about a couple of, it's been about four days or so that I've been wearing these and actually layering them and seeing how they work for me. And also too with these, um, sometimes I think they don't really last that long on the skin, but they're fine. That's fine for me because usually I touch up anyway. They're um, great for touching up with and you can layer them to make the scent last a little bit longer. Definitely like Pacifica's perfume. I'm really, really impressed with these. Actually, these roll-ons, I'm really, really impressed. Um, usually when you think of roll-ons, you think of like old lady or something like that. But no, these are really, really great. The scents are amazing, especially for it to be natural. Love this uh, 100%. I'm, I really do like and I will be looking to get fuller sizes of their perfumes um, in the future. Also, I went ahead, last thing, lastly, I went ahead and I grabbed the Pacifica Island Vanilla Body Butter. I went ahead and I grabbed this. I was curious. And I was like, all right, let me grab a body butter and see what they're working with. Um, this is a beautiful, a beautifully sophisticated exotic blend of Tahitian vanilla. Loved for its fruity and slightly floral aroma anchored with creamy and satisfying rich of bourbon vanilla. Once again, it's 100% vegan, cruelty-free, no par parabens, no mineral oil, um, no peanut oil or petroleum, so it is all natural. And I have worn this a couple of times because, like I said, I wanted to make sure, give it a full review. And so, um, now, when I initially wore this, I did not like it. I was like, it smells like plastic to me. Like, it smelled like a plastic type of vanilla. I don't know if you guys have ever smelled those vanillas that smell like plastic. Like, they're, like, kind of plasticky. I don't know if it's just me. But and I like the perfume more than the body butter. But like I said, I've worn these, and I've gotten a lot of compliments. Like, oh, that smells really good. What are you wearing? And I'm like, oh, okay, you know. But I like the perfume more than I like the scent, scent-wise, of the body butter. The body butter is very moisturizing. 
it doesn't make me go wow like I probably would just use this as like a hand cream it doesn't make me go like wow you know uh like for example like maybe like the shea butter like i mean the shea moisturizers um lotions now those are really good they make me go wow but this doesn't make me go wow it makes me go okay so i really wouldn't repurchase this again uh yeah i really wouldn't repurchase it but like i said i would just like use it to like for my hands or something like that and then you got to be careful because if you put too much on of this on it gives you like that uh that white residue that you have to continue to have, that you have to continue to rub into your skin for a while and that was a little bit annoying but I mean it's not that bad I would use it just for my hands though but I would not repurchase this and this was uh, $10 and 20 cents and like I said I used a coupon on these so I did get it a little bit less than what it cost and this is 10.5 fluid ounces so yeah, that's exactly how I feel about the body butter. I would not repurchase the body butter. I definitely am in love with their perfume and it's just that I like the fact that I can layer these and they smell really good and for them to be all natural is right up my alley. So as far as the perfumes go, Pacifica, I'm really, really impressed and I'm really, really um, satisfied. I'm definitely going to get my hands on those full size bottles and yeah so that is my full review of the pacifica perfume and body butter if you guys enjoy make sure to thumbs up this video and if you have tried Pacif pacifica and if you have tried pacifica let me know down below let me know what is your favorite scent what is your favorite body butter have you tried the body butters do you like the body butters let me know down below thank you so much for watching this your girl Eunice Marie make sure to rate comment subscribe all that fun stuff and I will see you in a later video bye